just so you can get an idea. So this is my rear bed. This is my bedroom window. They're back by my bedroom. There's the shed. So you get an idea of where they are. Now they're trying to hide their signal. Really, really tough guys there, huh? I'm sure you all saw that. And then they have all this projected stuff in front of my windows. They have, they have implanted things in the ground, devices in the ground. And then uh, they have, uh, with a the crowbar, they have separated the fence that I bought, which was specifically board on board to keep there from being any gaps. And they are purposely putting gaps in the back. So they project images. The combination is, is they project images from from the ground and from the back. And then they pass around this rumor that I believe in invisible people. I do not believe in invisible people. I do think that there are optical illusions and I think that they are making use of those. And they're using a lot of high-tech equipment to do it that is not available to the average citizen. Because otherwise, you would see the human being who is attached to that uh, pinkish-purple signal. And that's why they're trying to hide it now, because uh, that's proof that there is something there. There's somebody there who, who's using that device, which is what makes it flash. It's some sort of communication, I'm guessing. And uh, they just don't want you to see the signal because then that means there's somebody there and hello you can't see that somebody so they really don't want that to be known and they've hacked my computers and my cell phone so they're trying to keep me from putting these videos uh, out there for people to see because they don't want to be caught these really bold courageous brazen tough guys really don't want to be caught Aren't they something? Picking on a disabled person. Isn't that great? Just really, really awesome people. Get to know your neighbors. If I hear one more lecture from the police about how I need to be a good neighbor to these people, I, uh, I swear I... <laughs> I, it's unpleasant because uh, I don't go on their property and I haven't retaliated in any form outside of probably muttering some awfully choice words. Uh, just really, really awful. I can't wait to get away from these people. And they already know that we're moving. So the point here is not to get us to move because we're already going to move because who wants to live next to this? The point is to continue being mean because that's all they have and it's all they are. That's their very existence. And that tells you all you need to know about them. <laughs>